Good day, everyone. Welcome to another episode of Mom, mom and Son, Son Podcast. Podcast. This is Rose Fresh Fausto, the mom, also known as FQ Mom. And this is Anton Fausto, the son. So, I'd like to greet everyone again. Another great week. Happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday, everyone. It's August. It's already August. It's late August now. So, yeah. we're really approaching the end of we're, the year now. We're approaching now. the bear months. Yes. And that means that it's almost Christmas. And there are some, ano nga, there's some places na na me Christmas lights na. Ako na ex, ako na excited ako dun. I I enjoy because it means magap na birthday. Yeah, you're a you're December a seven. Christmas baby. Yeah. Okay. okay. So today our topic will be our traveling tips. Okay. So everybody, I I would like to say and believe that everybody likes to travel in mm-hmm. their own ways. There are some na who would like to go traveling in a very adventurous, extreme way. Mm-hmm. There are some na they feel like going to the Probably going to the mall and started traveling for them. But said, there, there's everybody. Everybody has their own versions of traveling, their own um, thousand travel experiences. And today we'll be talking about and sharing our okay. travel tips. Of course, the financial aspect of, of it. How do you uh, make the most like, out of each peso you spend? Yeah, and uh, let's also traveling. talk about the benefits yes. of traveling. Yeah, it's not just for ano. Hindi lang siya pang relax or pang pastress na ako sa trabaho, mm. travel na ako yun. And there's this, there's this quote, kasi a famous quote. I would say na traveling is the thing that you can spend money on that will make you richer. Mm-hmm. Yung quote kasi it said it's the only thing that will make you richer. Pero you know naman there are investments, yeah, yeah. there are um, things that would make you stocks. Yeah, that will make you richer that you spend. Uh, maybe it it really means that it's an expense because traveling uh, really is an expense. But it's an expense that makes you earn something in yeah. return, no? Parang hindi lang siya nawala lang. Okay, yeah. and maybe those are the benefits of traveling. Kung ano yung mga nagiging advantages. Okay. So what would travel. be the, what would be some of the benefits? Let's start with that. Okay, the, sige. Um, I think traveling really broadens your horizon. Diba? So para bang if you are very uh, local, bawa nandito ka uh-huh. na, and then when you get out of the country, nakakakita go wide din yung perspective mo, di ba? Para bang, ay, ganito pala, ganito pala sila. Kasi sanay tayo kung ano na nakikita natin everyday. Eh. Yeah, these are things that you can read about or you can mm. watch on whatever, movies and, and shows and everything. But then, nothing will ever defeat the, yung first-hand experience mo talaga of Uh-oh. being able to be in a different culture. Kasi when you're, you can get a new perspective if you are able to experience other people with the way they think and their yes. different backgrounds. Yeah. And, and you know what that does? It now um, enhances your creativity. You come mm-hmm. up with even original ideas na maybe even if it's not totally, totally original idea, but you are now able to connect things in another way. So, nagkakaroon ka ng original connections. Ay, ganito pala yun. Ay, alam mo yung... Um, Ano ba tawag mo doon? Yung tea? Ano ba? Yung sumobrang uso ng tea noon. Milk tea. Hindi, diba? even before the milk tea eh. Uh, pa, baka panahon mo pa yun. <laughs> yung, yung sa Bokongway Company. So parang, nung nag-travel siya, nakita yun, oh my okay. gosh, the tea ah, is... Ah, it's a... so big here. Oh, C2. And then he, ah, okay. C2. Then he brought it here to and the And then place. we became a big tea, mm, um, kumbaga, tea uh, user consumer. in the time. Yeah, consumer. okay, okay. So, yung mga ganon. No? So, it broadens your horizon. Broadens your horizon. And, and this is something... creative. This, that's something I really was able to experience okay. when I went on JTA. All right. So, the junior is... junior term abroad, mm. uh, it's um it's an exchange, student exchange program back in third year college when mm. I was studying at Ateneo. Now, we were able to study in a different country and I was fortunate and blessed enough to be able to get in mm-hmm. and... I have the chance to study in Nantes. So no, not many people know that region, that, that city, not It's spelled as Nantes. Nantes. Yeah, it's a two hour train away from Paris. It's in France. Yes. And I would say that would be one of the most intense, life-changing experiences I had. Uh-huh. So those four months and then you lived alone. Well, I lived with some Filipinos, some uh, of my batchmates. We were four in one what tawag them, one flat. One flat, yes. Yeah, but then Part everything, you had to, you had to, I learned how to cook because of that, thanks yes. to YouTube. <laughs> I, I had to wash my own clothes. Yeah. I'd like to say iron my own clothes, but I didn't take so iron. So you became an iron man. Then. Yeah. Oh, so, diba? And connected to that, diba? When you travel, especially with other people, you get to know them more. Yeah. Diba? In fact, you get to know more of yourself. Kasi na iba yung environment mo. So how am I with this kind of environment, yeah. with this unfamiliar environment? And you also get to know 
your travel companions. There is no better way to uh, to know a person than to see him na bago. Ah, kasi may well. muta pa or paano siya yeah, mainit. Yeah, if you travel. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Diba? You're just together and you can't, mm-hmm. you're, you're forced to just be together kasi you don't know anybody else in wherever you yeah. are. Okay, so what are the other oh, so it's an, the other benefits? Yeah, it's it's an exercise of being ano din, um, ano yung patience. Mm. Diba? Kasi when you travel, there are a lot of uncertain things in it that would happen. So, now you're able to test yourself in this different situations. Kung minsan, diba yung mga babagal gumamit ng banyo? Yeah. And you, <laughs> so, and you wouldn't, you won't, you won't be able to tell if if that's the way they really do it kasi in that country, if it's normal. Kasi baka where you came from, it's not... Uh, really normal. And uh, let me think of an example. Well, oh, it's better, Shepard. The roads are much better when I go to, if you're able to go to first world country. Other countries, well, there's a lot of traffic, people follow the rules. Okay. Those are some of the benefits. But then, the thing I would say I miss the most, Tagaga, when I studied abroad, would be the humor of Filipinos. Because <laughs> the slightest, you know how it, it's, an example would be, it's funny if someone uh, makes a play with words na this English word sounds like this other word pala. Or something like that. Those type yes. of things na I try to make a hear it na good. That's no one's gonna get it. Of course, it. because it's a different culture eh. Yeah. They don't understand your uh, nuances of your language. Yeah. Yeah. So, okay. So, it, it, para bang it makes you more tolerant. Di ba? Mm. Kasi may mga, kailangan marunong ka mag-plan A, mag-plan B. Yeah. Di ba? No? Pag nagta-travel ka. And I'm sure you, you experience that when you go out with your friends. Di ba? Mm-hmm. Meron kang kahit na gusto, gusto mo siyang friend tapos nung nag-travel kayo, teka, ayoko siya kasama. Ah, Masyado siya malakas mag-snore. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Or medyo dumi-kumawit na banyo. I'm actually lucky that hindi makagat yung mga kasama ko. When uh-huh. I, when I, when they were, I would, baka ako na nga yung pinaka, uh, ang tawag, yung pinaka messy. And mm-hmm. I'd like to believe I'm not a messy person. <laughs> just a messy eater. <laughs> messy eater. Mm-hmm. Pero were you a good cook? Who was cooking? I, I was a cook. Yung cooking ko kasi would be the pinaka basic eh. Chicken, tapos you just bake it in the oven. Ah, okay. So Ma- just throw it in the oven. Yeah, yeah. Whatever simple and efficient. Mm-hmm. Kung masarap naman, edi. Okay na. Mm-hmm. Sinagugas ng pinggan. Ah, depende. It, you would take turns sa that. Yeah, yeah. If I cook, I don't, I don't, I'm not the one who washes the dishes. I think that's also why I enjoy cooking. Kasi I didn't have to clean after. Ako, I notice about myself is I'm more OC about order and cleanliness when we're traveling. If you mm-hmm. notice, diba, ah, you have to put your things here. Gina, gina. Yeah, yeah. Kasi eh, parang ikaw ay talaga gagawa eh. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Kaya dapat and, and speaking ako. of like, you, you knew something about yourself. One of my major, one of the ma- um, discovery? Yeah, discovery. And one of the mo- most important things I like to talk about today would be yung knowing yourself. Because yeah, yeah. when you travel, like, uh, besides looking at the benefits of it, how you can improve as a person, it's really important to know yourself, what you want, and mm. what your values are. Because these are the ones that are going to sort of dictate how you go about with this traveling journey of yours. Whether yeah. it's a vacation, yes. whether you travel for work, or mm. for any other reason, you need to know what, um, do you want? what, you, yeah, what you want to do, what you value. Because uh, going first to vacations, at the topic of vacations, there are family vacations, there are solo vacations, or vacations with friends. You need to know what your values are what you want to do. Some people like to, their definition of traveling would be going out, seeing the world, mm-hmm. uh, going all to the museums, trying out yeah, all these different yeah. things. There are others, like our family, na they like to, we like to relax. Yeah. When you go on a vacation, we want to do one thing in the day and yeah, spend the rest of the day. We don't want uh, no, no full pack day. Yeah, I don't like getting tired. we've experienced before, especially when you were younger, it's eh. Yeah. Ah, kapagod. Yung, alam mo yung Disney namin, natin na, parang, at the end of the day, uh, ano, ka, ni the day yung tam na nakaglitaw ng ganyan. <laughs> uh, tapos, eh, pero, uh, some people would still really enjoy that. Mm-hmm. They're able to cover a lot of places, mm-hmm. a lot of things to do, but, maybe, yung naging, ano natin, naging hilig natin, we also want yeah. to relax. So, we just have to choose. What do we want to see? So, pipiliin mo na. Para at the end of the day, hindi ka masyadong ubos. Kasi pag naubos ka, baka the following day, masayang na yeah. yeah. And that goes to the, the that, that, that's directly related to the way you spend with it. The, yes. Your money, yes. uh, the way you deal with money when you travel. Kasi uh, inevitably naman, if you're gonna travel, you're gonna spend. So, yeah. you have to know what are those that you 
really value the things you want to do. So, so you, you prioritize. Okay to, yes. You have to be on the same page. That's why, example, like our family, we would want to spend on, example, like good accommodation. Kasi, because of me. <laughs> yeah, because of me. Mostly because of mama. Because um, uh, that's where we stay most of the time. Most of the time. Uh, some and there people, are times, kasi, diba, especially if you have mga activities na medyo too much na for me, I would sometimes a lot of times. <laughs> Actually, I, I think it became older. normal. Eh. Example, uh, if we went hiking in, the in a skiing, divided. Yo, hiking, ah. Mama stayed in a room or cafe. Oh, so that was the room. Yeah, so, or when we tried snowboarding, Mama had to stay in the room. Parang oh. ganun na. It you have to know. No, I went the first day. I went with you the skiing, divided. Just ah, to, okay. to have a. Feel. But I think Dika and I went again. Eh. Yeah, you went again. You stayed stay in the room, na. Yeah. Ang ganda ganda na nung yung Even even with uh, when it comes to like my experience of traveling with friends, you have to all be on the same page. Because mm-hmm. me right now, actually, I really love, I really really enjoy going to the beach. Na I would calendar my months with. Remember, there's work in the week. You go out sometimes on weekends, and then what's the next? No, what's the next beach? Because like you wanna, I just enjoy it. The sand, the sun. Me, what I value is being able to spend time on the beach. Do, not, e- even just doing nothing. No? Even just doing nothing would be fine. Like if I go to a, like I enjoy surfing, but then the most important thing, surfing because then can also cost a lot. Eh. Now, some people would prefer to just spend it on a, 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 a lots of food or something. Mm-hmm. You have to know what you want to do and not be forced to spend on things you want to do. If you don't like surfing, na man, mm-hmm. you don't need to. You don't need to spend the money you don't want to spend if you don't want to do it, if you don't value it. Tayo rin. Hindi rin tayo super mahilig sa shopping. Ah, uh, yeah. Pero, as much as... Pero pag, pag may outlet, titira tayo. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'd like to say naman, we would shop the average, the right amount. Kasi I can't... I don't I don't know anyone that doesn't want to buy stuff. Like, it's such a... Henry. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> and yeah, he doesn't like he doesn't like money stuff. He's not into shopping. Yeah, there are some that they would really travel and plan and that's their day. The, uh, they will scrimp on their accommodation, yeah, yeah. on their fare, so that they will have shopping money. Shopping money. money. And that's their thing. That's their thing. Because, oh, you know, for a lot of people, that's the case. Because it's more tangible. Eh. So yeah. when they come home, they can really see and feel and even use the things that they spend yes. their money on. So, parang ganun yung trip nila. Ako naman, parang mas gusto ko service. Ah, uh, yeah. As yeah. I got older, na, na nasisiyahan na ako sa mga magagandang service, I would really enjoy That's service. That's what you value. Yeah. So, if, for example, if I, when I last went to Thailand, mm-hmm. I think I spent more on massage rather mm. than shopping. Kasi shopping in Thailand is also it's also ano big eh, but fun kasi and that is also mura. known for their are they known they are they're known they, for their massages no, right? I'm not such a massage that's why they're too. super known for very they good are, massages okay. so, so you, have, ako, you spend on it oh, oh, so hindi na ako bumili ng mga maraming mga damit at kung ano doon kaya nagagaling yung maraming items from Green Hills so mas mura pa siya doon <laughs> yeah sa Thailand so, so ganun you have to know um, so that when you allocate your money resources, mm-hmm. no? Doon mo siya gagamitin. Not just money, eh, even time. Yeah. So when you allocate your resources, you're able to prioritize the things that you really value when you travel. So ngayon, sa, sa, sa mga FQ report tips sa traveling, yeah. it's good that we you always take a look at yung mga good deals sa airfare. Kasi yan naman yung malaking uh, yeah. gastos, eh. That would be the biggest, the, the biggest, tawag doon, and most obvious Mm-hmm. expense na mm-hmm. it will be a significant okay. percent sa kaya okay yung mga seat sale oh seat mga... sale tapos kung minsan nagkakaroon ng mga anong tawag mo dun yung travel fair mm, yeah. I think that's where you bought the tickets yeah, yeah. for this upcoming travel that we're mm-hmm. having di ba so pero dapat mag prepare ka din dun alam mo na talaga kung anong gusto mong mangyari so when you're there, deba naka decision ka na rin dapat because you have I think you have to transact there in order to get the discounts. Eh? Mm-hmm. Obvious trip uh, obvious tip for your trip na you have to plan early kasi I remember oh, oh. Uh, oh, 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 so I just of this year pa lang eh. Mm-hmm. I want, I've been I'm, I'm, I'm having like a beach phase like, and I really enjoy going to beach. Siyempre, mm-hmm. iba naman if you if you go to the beach with your friends or with your own money. Get different shape. Yeah, okay, so difference, yeah, the difference <laughs> The big difference would be yun. Kasi, um, 
you can't I can't doubt I can't deny the fact na enjoy ko rin yung mga in-enjoy ni mama na mga good service na <laughs> oh yung magandang hotel or <laughs> yung 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 service talaga customer service but then when I go and when I travel I really just, I want to go to the beach because I want to go to the beach and I just find the cheapest way the most mm-hmm. affordable way to go there yeah. and Spartan obviously yan tao din Spartan na hobby niya <laughs> so yun yun yung pinupandaan ko but then with this one it's different kasi Di ka gagasos. Yeah. Mga 50 year olds na yung kasama ko. So, syempre, <laughs> dapat maganda yung mga kama. <laughs> anyway, um, it's, although it's gonna be a different experience, the same, I believe the same rules still apply. You need to first know what do you value, what you want to do. Mm-hmm. And since it's our year-ending um, vacation, tra- traveling, we want to go to a nice place where we can relax mm-hmm. and have our yearly meeting, have a, have a good place to have our yearly goals Goal setting, uh, goal setting meeting. Yeah, they have, they have another actually good tip, pala, that I uh, mm-hmm. I remember. Because, di ba, sometimes, pero sa atin kasi mad- madali lang gawin. Kasi hindi talaga tayo soda drinker, di ba? Uh, you can really save a lot of money then on that. The, I remember the first time we went to Disney. I read up on it, ano, para bang okay. saving, uh, para para the cost efficient way of going, going to Disney. To Disney oh. Nakalagay, there's a study na ang laki-laking amount goes to the purchase of Coca-Cola. Oh, really? Pero because the Coke there is more expensive than when you yeah, buy it in a course. convenience store. But did you really go all the way to Disney to to just to Coke? drink Coke? Uh, diba? So if you can save up on that, it's I mean, those little things. Eh. Tubig, diba? It's those little things. Oh, oh, and that would be things. my ano rin, uh, connect, connected to that would be my water jug yeah, practice. Yeah. Not just for that, it's also for. Mostly on movies. Ah, sorry. Yeah, yeah, hell. But then I usually do it if I want to watch a movie in a cinema. Mm-hmm. Bring a water jug because it's going to save you 30 pesos. It's better yeah. for the environment. Correct. Yeah, and, and you have water with you oh. all the time. And then when you're traveling, naman, sa mga magagandang parks, they have potable water. Naman, na mm, yeah, and if they have those, naman, okay. Na. Oh, so, if you're going to have a water, then you're going to have a water, you're going to have a water, you're going to have a fountain. Ka na. Yun yun. So, those little things kasi eh. Tapos kung minsan, topic of the Pasa Nubo. Mm. Very Pinoy. Puso yun, yan. very Pinoy. Oo. So pag magta-travel, parang if you're gonna meet um, relatives abroad, parang kailangan. It's a requirement. Oh, by the way, ah, kung nakikipadala ka kayo, be considerate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> be considerate naman. Kasi may hirap eh. Especially kung hindi yun yung unang uh, stop na pupuntahan mo. And if it takes a lot of space. Ah, yeah, because it's gonna be together with them on their whole thing. Yes, yeah. di ba? Tapos kaya, kuminsan may mga ipapadala mga pagkain na alam naman nating bawal. Ah, uh, yeah. Itaan ko muna yan sa luggage. Huwag na. Yeah. Huwag na. That's a basic ano. Uh-huh. Oh, and I have some FQ repo tips when it comes to traveling. If you're in your younger years pa naman, the most budget. Conscious. Uh, yeah, budget conscious ka pa. Okay. So, the first one would be, ah, for the family side pala, it would be nice to try out some place new. Uh, that, I think that's more of a personal preference that you and Papa like to do. Try out some place new every yes. year. Yes. Yeah, okay. So for the other one, solo trips. Hmm. Um, solo first, trips are also my good first, for you. Yes. For my first tip uh, to be FQ conscious about it is to stick with the local. Kung mm-hmm. ano, kung kaya naman. Kasi, ah, if you're gonna people, go on a solo trip. If you're gonna trip. pick, yeah. Solo trip or trip with friends. Kasi yung budget. Okay. It'll be good. Kasi first, if it's local, obviously it's cheaper mm-hmm. airfare. Mm-hmm. And we know naman, agam na natin yung um, the pricings here in the Philippines of like water. If, if para, we can tell eh, kung mahal ba yung tubig, mahal ba yung pagkain. Uh-huh. Kasi we, we live here and we don't need to exchange the money for something else. And there are, more important than, bigger than that, is that there are so many beautiful places in the Philippines that, that you can go to that aren't as famous but not, not everywhere not every beach is Boracay mm-hmm. although Boracay is still probably Boracay. the best beach I've been to there's still so many there are a lot of, of good places to go to oh and by the way we are also tops when it comes to customer service ah, so yeah. ang sarap talaga dito remember when we were in Hawaii na lo- mm-hmm. uh, Naloka tayo yeah. dun sa... There was the oh It was Papa who was yeah. asking something. As we and this not, is already a this hotel is our, personnel. our hotel that we were staying oh, in. Oh, which is a good hotel. Hindi yeah, siya, so we yeah. went downstairs dun sa where the, I think, where the van was or something. And we, my, Papa just wanted to ask for directions. Hmm. And he saw someone wearing the same... Naka name tag pa yata eh. Oh. Name tag and then the Hawaiian shirt yes. that the, the hotel staff is wearing. 
And then he asked, excuse me, can I ask, like, where's the whatever? And then he just goes, oh, sorry, I don't work here. Yes, and we were just thinking that baka nag off na siya. Better, yeah. But then, like, why would you be wearing the same uniform exactly, and name tag? Exactly, exactly. And I think probably it was, baka he was still five. It was like 5, 10 p.m. Yes, Para yes. So, nakagpas na, na siya. <laughs> ah, grabe, and then someone ng Oh, oh my God. Favor. And you cannot experience, you'll never experience that kind of treatment from a Filipino. Yeah, I'd like to believe so. I think I've never, I have never. Uh, sobrang babait think, kaya yeah, natin. Yeah, yeah. Now, we go beyond what is expected. Mm-hmm. And that's why we are very good service providers, eh. Na dito po, da, 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 da. Yeah, and you want to make sure that you do everything you can mm-hmm. to make that guest um, comfortable. comfortable, happy with their experience. Oh. And my next tip would be the more, the merrier mm-hmm. and cheaper. Because, example, kung road trip, okay. and then you're more the car, syempre, edi, you divide the gas, yes. the toll, ah. if you have to pass through the toll gate, the toll fee is less, and it just makes it just makes it easier if you're more people. Like, if you wanna spend on this nice thing, if you're more, I think it's more me to divide. As simple as that. And lastly, with the friends, mm-hmm. um, going back to what I was talking about, kanina pa would be to go with friends who share the same values mm-hmm. when it comes to what you are looking for in yeah. whatever traveling that you're doing. Because uh, you can have, um, you, you, it's possible to have a lot of friends, but then ibahi yung the ones you want to travel with. Except you wanna be able to spend on the same thing, sana. Uh-huh. To experience the same things, the things that you want to do. Mm-hmm. Ayan, Sa group nyo, who usually takes the lead? Like, is there like a person who would do your itinerary? Uh, well, usually it's because it usually would be me, especially when I go oh, yeah? out with my teammates from college. Okay. Because well, one, I I also one, especially if we go to any place in the north. So if mm. we go to Pampanga, visit my friend the Gans, or if we go to La Union, a okay. beach that we go to a couple of times. You buy not because it's northbound. Ah, so do not have Yeah, put it again. So I don't need to. I want. I don't need to wake up early. I don't need to find a ride. But parang get so it's it's from. So it's the meeting. Yeah, place. and then you know, since I plan it, so I did it. I don't know plans it. So I kind of have a say in what we are gonna do. Ah, no. how do you resolve conflicts when traveling? Oh, bah, you know, would be more of like democracy. Yung voting again. Oh, voting again. Time is such a good thing, talaga. Eh, it's not just fun to do, talaga. It's very, yes. it's very educational, and it gives you confidence, especially, diba, if you have tried to travel alone. Yeah, you need to talk. I said, there's no one who's gonna oh. do it for you. If you wanna go somewhere, if you need something, you have to be done to look for it. Find a way to look for that thing. Mm, so it boosts your confidence, and it also improves your social and communication skills. Oh, tell us about yeah. your communication uh, <laughs> barriers. Oh diba? my you gosh! You lived in countries that didn't speak. Didn't uh, they speak speak English? English. It was a hard time. I can't. First one is the one in Korea. Was that? The oh first yeah. One? And in you were Korea, very young and at then the time. and you were yeah, I was high school. I was a different person back then, and I can't say na you know what I did a great job. It was just hard. But it was, the, the, the reality of it was it was I didn't have an easy time yeah, language talking. Language barrier. Yeah, I would go to Dunkin' Donuts because it, it, it it's was in easiest. English. <laughs> 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 so, you know, you know, na, ah, just have to look for the um, the most relatable, simplest way. And commuting also, like uh-huh. the buses, buti lang they had numbers. Because uh-huh. everything else is Korean characters. Yeah. I mean, although I have like kodigo of what Korean character Did the bus should Did you ever feel ride. like you wanted to cry na? Ah. Uh, Hindi naman na par- I never really. No? first year. Second year going to third year high school. Ah, year so I was like 15, parang mm-hmm. ganun I didn't have a breaking down moment. But there, syempre, I got. Sad. Although it was just one month, I, I was homesick. I got na. Na parang, oh my gosh, na. Maga, maga, pamilya ko, maga, friends ko. No one gets the jokes I like. Pero buti na lang, Korea uh, has a lot of rice. So at least there's something that close to home. Yeah, I love Korea. I love the, the steamy. Yeah, na, na. But then, of course. You only travel if you have more than enough uh, resources and money to do so. Mm-hmm. You don't travel, you don't take a loan, you don't, take, yes, please you don't, don't. borrow money uh, don't. just to be able to check out a new place. Yeah, so don't something... use your credit card uh, to buy your ticket unless you can easily pay for the entire balance In when cash. the statement comes. Uh, hindi yung parang, oh, uh, since the trip is gonna be two months from now, I have more money by then. I can use the okay. I can use my my sueldo from oh, next next month. Oh, wag kasi yeah. when you swipe it now and then hindi mo pa babayaran in full, that means you will be charged interest. Yeah. Eh, para sa akin, luxury din yan eh. Mm-hmm. And luxury can be delayed. Yes. So you should always always delay your luxury. 
And of course, really, traveling is real life education. Yes. Yun naman yung pinaka importante dun eh. And alam mo, maiksi nga ang buhay eh. Kaya ko minsan, we're thinking, oh my gosh, where else do you want to go? How hmm. many more years? Can so my that... body oh, take traveling? Oh my gosh, mga Africa, Africa dyan. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so there. Um, it's it's really fun to travel. It's educational. And it's a, it's great bonding time, no? Yes. With people, with, with people around you. And I can say that it's great bonding time with yourself. Like it's, also. Since you are alone, you feel more alone since you don't know the environment uh, the people uh-huh. around you. You're forced to be able to be okay with your own company. And yeah. that's, I, that's a life skill I think everybody should have. Yep. Great. Yeah, and so safe travels to everybody who's yes. listening to this. Hopefully, now you guys get to pick up a thing or two from the tips we gave. Um, so you can keep traveling safe, keep making the most fun out of it, and we'll catch you guys again next week for another episode of Mom, mom and Son, Son Podcast. Podcast. This has been Rose Fresh Fausto, the mom, also known as FQ Mom, and Anton Fausto, the son. Thanks, guys. Bye. Mom and Son Podcast airs every Tuesday, 7 a.m. or anytime at your convenience and can be streamed on Spotify, Buzzsprout, Apple iTunes, Google Podcasts, and YouTube. Just search Mom and Son Podcast for your weekly dose of family, finance, passions, and everything in between. For all your questions and comments, email us at antonfausto at gmail.com.